Okay, this time I'll show you that Vine also works on Raspberry Pi Zero. At first, what uh, do I have to do? I have to have this J road um, VZ i386, and I have to have this executable start x86 environment Vine user. Now I'm running this script. Wine user. Now I j root it into this environment and I can run any program with wine. Wine notepad, for instance. And on Raspberry Pi Zero, this is really, 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 really slow. And as soon as it is starting up, I can show you a bit how it works in general. So, when we have our Raspberry Pi. It works on an ARM CPU. And on top of this ARM CPU we are running the Linux OS. And on top of this Linux OS, we run a user program called QEMU Wine. QEMU, uh, QEMU i386. And what? So this is our host CPU. This is our host uh, operating system, and this is an emulator that emulates the behavior of a x86 CPU which is used by the Windows programs and on top of this QEMU so QEMU can run x86 executables but before we can do this we have to have a whole environment so we have to so we have to... Now, Notepad is opened. You see it really works. And we can write nasty things into Notepad. And this is all running on a Raspberry Pi Zero. I can say file, open, and you see it's really slow. But it works. I already saved a file. I can open that file now. Do I want to override this file? Do I want to save changes? I say no. And I open this file. It says hello raspy. So this is the console output of our wine. Typical console output of wine. So before we can run so with QEMU we want to run Wine, which emulates uh, the Windows API and on top of Wine we can run Notepad. But before we can run any program, we have to use, um, we have to have a complete x86 environment. So we jroot and do bin FMT. So we bin FMT. This is the whole schematics how it works. <coughs> our host CPU, our host operating system, and we j root. We so we change our root system to a subfolder of our uh, original root system, and the subfolder. Um, 
I can show you this subfolder because this is exactly this folder Sherwood Weezy and when you look at this it is a complete Linux installation based on the x86 architecture. So when I look into the bin folder I have all these tools like grab all for the x86 architecture and by jrooting into this folder I set the root node to this folder so this is then the new root and because an ARM CPU cannot just run uh, things like grab or gzip um, on its uh, CPU we have to uh, create a bin format um, control file and this bin format tells the Linux kernel that when we fork and exec a file that is not ARM architecture but x86 that it should run it with QEMU uh, i386. So bin FMT tells Linux to run x86 Linux executables via QEMU. Now we have Wine. Wine is a uh, also a Linux executable with x86 uh, architecture and Wine can then run notepad dot exe. So we have our ARM Linux and we have our x86 Linux emulated and on top of that we can emulate x86 Windows. I think that's it for today. Um, this image also works for Raspberry Pi 3, but I think it's more impressive to show it with Raspberry Pi 0. Thanks and bye bye.